Good morning. It is another week. It's Memorial Day. Um, I don't know if we're supposed to say Happy Memorial Day or it's kind of weird, but whatever it is, it's Memorial Day. <laughs> so, um, and yes, I'm very thankful for what our soldiers have gone through. I have several family members who have passed on. Um, they did not die in combat, thank God, but um, they are, they were soldiers. So anyway, want a little update on the mold and the house and all that stuff? Here we go, they came over and they looked to see um, how bad the water damage was and they couldn't because they found mold and so um, he had to like tape back wherever he checked for mold. And then this water stain has grown um, big time. And the mold is actually starting to come through the wall. That white stuff there. That would be mold. Yes, isn't it wonderful? Just kidding. Hey, Lucky, can you say hi? All right. <laughs> and then, so we're getting our entire floor replaced. Which is cool. Um, kind of a pain, you know, but I'm trying to make the best of everything. So we pulled up the floor to see what it was, and my husband pretty much knew because he used to sell floors for a living, but it was Pergo. So, old Pergo. So hopefully, we're going to get Pergo again. And we chose this color. I hope it shows up on camera. Let's see. Oh, wait, let me get some natural light. Hold on. Let's make up the natural light. It is called Esperanza Oak. If you want to go and look it up. It's gray. However, in some light, it looks like it's um, tan. So it's kind of like this color that changes. It's really neat. They come tomorrow to actually tell me how much the mold remediation is going to be. And then they'll... Um, actually start that process and while they're doing that we have to be out of the house but we would probably after um, have to stay out longer just because of the actual hole that's gonna be in the floor right here so we have something that's called pier and beam so underneath our house is open like I think it's three feet tall it comes up to about my hips so Anyway, um, other people in this area have slabs, so there's no under the house. We don't have like a basement or anything like that, so. But it's the under the house part, and that has mold on it too. It's like, oh my God, it's bad. So anyway, that's what's been happening. Now, would you like an across the hall update? So, um, across the hall used to be in this room. <laughs> and now, we have all of our other stuff in this room because we had to empty out this room, which is almost completely empty. Um, except for a couple things over here. And then we have this in the kitchen. Everything else is empty. So I have moved. And actually, this is what I wanted to do anyway was a cross off. Um, whoa, I just bumped you guys, sorry. I wanted to move it into its own room so it wouldn't be out in the middle of everywhere and we could use the living room, like the living room. But, oh, Poppy, right, hold on. Just watching friends, obviously. So I have its own room now. So the desk will be gone eventually. Central Park is gonna go on this wall. And then I have, right now I have Ross's apartment set up because his is in the first episode. I'm working on the hallway, <laughs> painting it and stuff. It looks so bad on this camera. I really, really hope to get a new camera um, to film all this, but Monica's apartment is being set up again in here. So it will be, I had to kind of put everything away so I could move it or else, whoa. It would have fell over. And then I have this shelf and it's going to house like all the accessories and crafts and stuff. So, yeah. Anyway, that's what's going on with that. The only thing with this room is the walls are purple. 
and I'm afraid it's going to interfere with the with the um, coloring on the sets. Yeah, I think that's it. <laughs> I think that's all I have to say today. All right, well, thanks for watching, and please don't forget to subscribe, and please um, look for a link below to subscribe to Across the Hall if you want to see like what keeps happening with the set and when I actually start filming. Woo! So excited. There are a couple of videos up there um, where you can see me putting the sets together and stuff like that. Good morning, it's the next day. I'm gonna take these off. Because I know there's a glare. I was going to end the video yesterday and when I ended it. But then I just wanted to show you guys this morning. I came into um, this room. This, this room. <laughs> where we have our table right now. It's, it's technically a dining room. We just never used it that way. Um, well, I guess when we first moved in we did. But then after that, no. So I walked in with my food. And I was like. I walked in, I was like, you know, like tripping. And I was like, what is wrong with the floor? Okay. Supposedly, this floor was not damaged in the flood, whatever it is. Not flood, the leak. So I was like, it looks like it's warped. Especially, ooh, right here. Oh my gosh. I can feel it when I walk. Um, anyway, so I went and got a marble. Oops, of course now it's not going to work. There it goes. And I'm not giving it any sort of a push. It's like worse in some places. <clears throat> oh. Yep, there it goes. Huh. Let's see, maybe it was already this way and I'm just like very aware, you know. Yeah, it's right here. It's way worse. The mold lady is supposed to come today and tell us how much mold damage there is. So, I don't know if she's going to rip out the walls or she has like some way, some machine that tells. Like, I don't know. I don't, I don't understand. Also, I'm going to be making health videos, a lot of health videos. So, if there's something you want to know health related, let me know. And I will try to answer those questions and make videos about that specific thing okay um you can reach me here or on twitter at steph bogart it might be steph bogart one i really don't know but it's in the description below all right love y'all bye